7-8-9. Bruh, did they just like cheat me out of a product? I'm gonna have to call them. Hello everyone, my name is Sandra and thank you so much for tuning in. All right, y'all. So your girl, your girl got another mystery bag, as you can see. I think I'm obsessed. I think I'm a little bit addicted to these mystery bags and I'm okay with that. I went ahead and purchased this mystery bag from Ipsy. This one is supposed to come with 10 full size items. So I think I paid like 40 or $50 for this one. First of all, let's get into this bag. The bag is so darn cute. And look at the little Ipsy, ooh, the little Ipsy charms. I think that is so pretty. I love these little ridges on the Side. There's a beautiful detail. The back is just, you know, kind of regular. Unfortunately, it's probably gonna get dirty very easily because it's white, but beautiful to look at for now. I think I can keep it clean. I could try to keep it clean, but we'll see. But y'all, let's go ahead and get into this mystery Ipsy. See if we came up. Reaching into my bag, the first thing that I'm pulling out is, what is this? Multivitamin sheet mask by the same, the same. This looks like a Korean brand. It's just two little sheet masks. There's this one, this is the vitamin mask, and the other one is the hyaluronic acid mask. I'm hoping this counts as one and not two of my products. Cause you know, it's to be playing with us sometimes, okay? They be playing in our face. You know, you sign up, you get the, the mystery bag, it's supposed to have 10 full size items and then they give you a few samples in there and then they parade them around as if they're full size and they're not. We're gonna give it the benefit of the doubt until we see and count up all of our products that this hopefully counts as one item, but we'll see. And I'm not mad at face masks. I love to get a good face mask. The next thing in here is by JLo Beauty. And it's hard to read because of the way the packaging is. Very difficult to read. The Blockbuster Hydrating Cream. Okay, so it's just a little hydrating cream. Does this usually come in like its own box? Because I can't imagine that it just comes basic out like this, you know, just already like, shouldn't there be a box encompassing this? I, I don't know. But this is by JLo Beauty. I don't own anything from JLo Beauty. Well, I mean, I do now. But prior to this moment, I did not own any JLo beauty. This packaging is very clunky. It's very big, unnecessarily big. Cause this is only like 1.7 fluid ounces. Like you don't need all this, it's just 1.7 fluid ounces. This like extra chunk right here, I don't know. It's very pretty to look at. Don't get me wrong. It's very pretty to look at. I think this is so beautiful, but necessary? No, it's not necessary. It comes with a little nice little safety seal. And this is what the cream looks like. It just has like a skincare scent. Well, let's see what the texture is. Ooh, bruh, that's like a butter. You know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of that Tula moisturizer that I literally just got. That same buttery consistent, consist, what are words? Okay, what are words in the English language? Consistency. Is that same buttery consistency? Maybe even the same scent. I don't know. These might be the same product, just in different boxes. I don't know. I mean, it, it feels nice. Maybe I'll just have something I can use. This will be my middle-aged lady cream. Instead of my old lady cream, this will be my middle-aged lady cream, okay? In the fancy, fancy schmancy box. I think JLo Beauty is kind of expensive. So that's nice to have in a, in a mystery, mystery ipsy. Moving on, moving on. So far we're at two, hopefully two. The next thing in here is by Girlactic and is the Perfect Hair Eyeliner Duo. And this is what it looks like. The outside packaging is cute with the cute little iridescence. You can see yourself all up in that. Oh, it comes with two. I'm thinking it's like dual end. But no, it has two different, two different eyeliners. Let me see. One's chunky, one's chunky chunk and the other one's skinny mini. This first one is long wear gel eyeliner in pure brown. And this other one is a precision eyeliner marker in brown noir. I actually don't have any brown eyeliners. So I'm very excited to give these a try. Let's start with the one I'm probably not gonna like the most, which is the gel liner. Uh, I, I'm not a fan of gel liners. They just, they don't do it for me. You can't keep them sharp. The best thing you can use these for is to like deepen up your eyelash line or your water line. That's about it. You know, if you're trying to get a nice wing with one of these, girl stop. It draws beautifully, but you're not getting a sharp line forever because that's gonna flatten out over time. Let's see what this one is. Ooh. 
Okay, very nice. Beautiful. Okay, now this might be my girl. She drew on so beautifully. Very smooth. I don't see any little veins popping out. Hopefully this doesn't count as two when it's just one. But so far we're at three from my count. I'm not sure if we're at three for Ipsy's count. The next thing that I'm pulling out of here is by Vizar, and this is Professional Makeup Patty Bronzer. Now I've never heard of this brand, but this packaging is fancy. Packaging is fancy schmancy. Now hopefully this is a bronzer color that will work for my skin. To Ooh. Okay, this has to be fancy. Ain't no way, boy. Ain't no way you coming through with packaging like this and you're not fancy. That is so pretty. Look at that. And it says Vizar right on there. And this is like a little, little snap thing. That is so cute. I like that. It's like a little mirror right here. And then this is the actual bronzer. I think this color will actually look really nice on me. We'll give this a try at some point in time. I love this packaging. That just, that little, that little thing is just so cute. I'm honestly, I'm gonna keep it in here as well. I think this needs to stay as a unit. The next thing in here is something that I will not use. So this will be definitely going into a giveaway. I don't wear lashes. I like my natural lashes. I have put on fake lashes in the past. They make me feel uncomfortable because I always feel like they're gonna lift and then you're gonna look ratchet and they're heavy. And I just, I don't, I don't like heaviness on my eyes. I just, it's, it's not a fan. Put this in a giveaway and these are the Flirtatious Looks, Girls Night Out by Wing Girl. Is it by Wing Girl or is that just the name of, oh, okay, so this must be lash glue. Okay, that's nice. So you end up with a pair of eyelashes and in there is just like a little glue for the eyelashes, but it's not like in the typical kind of like typical lash glue thing that I've seen. This one actually looks like you draw it on like an eyeliner and then you stick them on. So that's actually pretty cool. I don't wear lashes. So somebody in my subscriber group is gonna get these cool lashes. It's for y'all, it's not for me. The next thing in here is by Gerard Cosmetics and is the Hydra Matte Liquid Lipstick. This is long wear and it is in the color Just Peachy. Now, I'm not a fan of liquid mattes or matte lipsticks at all, but because this is a peach, maybe I'll like it. You know, I'll give it a try. Does the cracking mean that it's old? I feel like the cracking means it's old. Moving past that, this packaging is super freaking cute. I love the frosted glass. You guys can't tell, frosted glass is that girl. It has cracking. Can y'all see that? Yes, you can, because I can see it with my glasses off. It's cracking so hard. It's a little chunky monkey. Ooh, it was a big old chunk that came off. It has a slightly sweet scent to it, like ever so slightly sweet. That is what the color looks like. Seeing it outside of the packaging, I don't know. I don't know, y'all. That that looks like it's gonna be hideous. That looks like it's gonna be hideous. Maybe with the right liner, it'll look right. But even when I drew it on, like it looks just patchy and chunky and just not smooth. I, I just, I, I don't think I'm a fan of that. So far, this is my least favorite thing that I've received. And I got eyelashes and I don't use eyelashes. Not sure if I like her at all. The next, thing that I've gotten in this bag, and this is pretty makeup heavy. We got like two skincare items and then everything else has been makeup. This next thing is by Del Mar. It is a highlighter in Cali Glow. Packaging is super freaking cute. Love that. Ooh, this packaging is, Packaging is very, very basic and simple. You just got like little persona right there. On the back, it shows you all the other stuff like the Del Mar and the Cali Glow. In the front, it's very simplistic, very minimalistic. And ooh, it comes with a nice little mirror and that is your highlighter. I think that is really pretty. It feels nice and that is golden, bruh. That is definitely a really nice highlighter. You can barely see it on my arm because it's like blending in with my skin tone, but it is very nice. It's very nice and shimmery. And I think for the right makeup look, it's gonna look gorgeous. Cute little highlighter, excited to try this. Okay, it's looking like there's two more things in here. That math ain't mathing for me. Hold up, wait. Okay, so we got one, two, three, four. This came together, so five, six, 
seven. They're counting this as two. Bruh, did they just like cheat me out of, out of a product? I'm gonna have to call them. I'm gonna have to call Ipsy and tell them to run me one more product because the math ain't math in here. Unless they're counting the bag as a product. I just, I've never seen them do that. I'm gonna call them because that's, that's, a, that's a hot mess. I don't like that. The next thing that I'm pulling out of here is by ColourPop and it is part of their Bambi collection and it is called Flower. That is super adorable. Ooh, the inside packaging is actually just as beautiful as the outside. Okay, ColourPop. Now those purples are beautiful. That is absolutely gorgeous. It comes with a mirror. That hibernating is such a beautiful dark purple along with that oh gosh and so shy. Man, I'm gonna be all up in this palette. That is so pretty. Let me do some swatches really quick for you guys. Look at those colors. That black is stunning. Do you see those purplish flex glitters in there? And then this middle shimmer is gorgeous. All the shimmers in this palette are stunning. The mattes are okay. Those shimmers are beautiful, especially that black. That is stunning. I'm gonna go wash my hands really quick and then we're gonna get into this last little item. And I'm back. For my ninth item, okay, instead of 10, my ninth item. This is so fun, bruh. This is a little floppy disk. <laughs> The newer generation is gonna look at this and not know what the F it is. But before there were CDs that you put into your computer, you had to put floppy disk. And I remember the floppy disk era, okay? I'm a 90s baby, so I remember very vividly having floppy disks. This packaging is so cute. And this is the Your Eyes Only Nine Pigments palette. And this is by Half Caked. Very cute. Oh, snap. This is so adorable. On the back where they have those like shade names, they look like little files for the computer. I I love those little details. I think that is so freaking a cute. Ooh, bruh, get into it. I think that is so fun, especially this middle shade right here. I am very excited to see what that looks like. This is kind of like every day. You can use this for like everyday looks. I'm not gonna swatch this whole thing, but I will do a few swatches on this arm. All right, y'all, look at those. Those went on so beautifully. Their formula is formulated, okay? It is absolutely formulated. I am super excited to play with this eyeshadow palette. This is actually really nice. I'm excited to try this out. I'm happy to have it in my collection. That was everything in my mystery Ipsy. I was supposed to have 10 products, but it has nine. There's only two things in here that I'm not gonna use. Everything else in here, I will definitely give it a try. I'm very upset that I have nine items instead of 10. That is unacceptable. <laughs> they need to run me my other products and just throw it in my next bag because I'm gonna make more purchases. So I'm gonna call them. I will let you guys know in like a community post if they make me whole or if they give me like a little bit of refund or what they do. But in the meantime, between time, if you like that content, that content, not that content, Content, this content. If you like this content, you already know what to do. Like, share, comment, and definitely subscribe so that you can become a Fei Bay. And I will see y'all with the next one. Deuces.